hello YouTube welcome back to my video so in this video I'm going to show you how you can uh, upload a file using a JSP project okay so in a JSP page we'll create and upload a functionality with a form and we'll upload that file into one of the local folder in our PC and we'll test that application so I'm going to create a new uh, dynamic web project and uh, the web project name I'm giving it as a JSP file upload okay now all others are I'm putting as uh, uh, default and just click finish and wait for your uh, Java uh, dynamic web project to be created okay now I'm going to create an index page here where we'll write our uh, form to uh, upload the file okay so I'm giving it as index.jsp and here the error comes so is there a Java Excelator error right yes to remove that just go to properties and where you can see here uh, runtime it's uh, yeah target runtimes select Apache 9 and press ok there will be gone there ok now here inside this I'm going to create a new form here so inside the sender tag I'm giving an header tag here and said that I'm giving as upload file form so I'll write a form here first so I have uh, given a form here so uh, to get the upload uh, file we have to uh, give a tag here and in type encode type so it's a multi part slash uh, form data which means there is file also to upload okay so I have given uh, a text box here to enter some value so I'm giving the uh, uh, text box data as enter file name and uh, there is a uh, browse option here so let me run this in tomcat server and see just uh, to run as just click on run on server so mine is uh, tomcat 9 just select that and just click finish and uh, wait for your project to be started project has started so let me uh, copy this and open in my google chrome as you can see here in the index.jsp I have uh, not set any form action the action tag is empty here so we have to submit uh, this to, to a uh, servlet actually so we'll create that servlet before that let's uh, open this uh, JSP page and see here it is so I have just opened this and here I have given an end file name uh, text box now we can select a file uh, dynamically from our PC and we can just pre press upload to upload this file to anywhere in our local PC okay now as I told we have to submit uh, this one uh, to a servlet for first so I have to create a servlet here so let me uh, create a package for that com dot chilifax.com so let me create a uh, servlet here first and uh, I'll try I'll explain how it works I have just created a servlet here file upload handler.java so we are in need of a java file here actually so we have to put that java file so the jar file uh, java file is this one commons file upload uh, dot jar so just copy this one and uh, paste it in our library folder here so all the import function has been done so the error is gone okay so uh, this is the file which we have just imported now what it does here is actually it will save our file in d uploaded files okay so in the folder d uploaded file it will be saved with the same file name with the we are giving in uploading the file okay so there is a text box here so enter file name so whatever we write here we are uh, accepting that in uh, this servlet and we are passing as a uh, URL, re URL request to the index.jsp itself so we will we'll process this after the file upload works okay so here is the uh, yeah, we have to do we have to uh, update the servlet information in the web.xml also so to create the web.xml is not here now just go to ee tool java ee tools and just click on generate deployment descriptor so the web.xml will be created okay so inside this we have to uh, we have to write the servlet information 
so to write the surveillance this is the code just copy this code and uh, paste it here and you have to update the servlet name here so the servlet name is file upload handler just copy it paste it here here and update the path of the servlet completely copy this and upload it here and just give the complete path dot file upload handler okay so i'm giving the url pattern also file upload handler okay okay now let's try running this one so just copy the path here you have to set this path uh, as the action tag so i'm just pasting that one so this action will be sub uh, submitted to file upload handler this one and it will process the request uh, i guess now let's try uh, running this uh, project completely let me restart the server completely now this is the form let me refresh the form also yes uh, the form is refreshed now i am giving the name as uh, test image okay i am uh, uploading a fi file here a, a picture image here so this is the picture image i am going to upload double click on the there and just click on upload and let's see the output what is coming so it's uploading yes so there is an error let's see yes uh, i got the error the error was due to we have to add one more uh, jar file in the library so i have just added it now let's uh, try running the project again now you can see i'm just giving the file name as eee -E -E, and uh, i'm giving a this one okay i'm uploading upload the penguins dot jpg now if i click upload we can see here i have forwarded uh, the file is uploaded and the file name is forwarded as this one and uh, if you are going to that folder which we have used to upload the file so the folder name is in d drive uploaded files let's see let's go to d drive uploaded yes uh, the file uh, is uploaded successfully using our code so let's uh, i i'll give a message here i'll try to give a message here after uploading okay so i have uh, just given a message here so if uh, the file name is the i'll receive that file name and i'll give a message here okay now let's go back to uh, the project let me refresh completely i'm going to upload a new fresh file i'm giving the name as uh, the uploader file i'm giving it as uh, tulips okay so the file name i'm giving it as flowers and if i'm just uploading it here you can see here flowers file has been uploaded successfully so the flowers is taken from uh, this url and it will print the message flowers has been uploaded successfully and here the flowers has been tulips.jpgs uh, uploaded in data uploader files okay so hope you got this i have explained how you can upload a file using a jsp uh, project so we have tried the, uh, to upload their file and the file was uh, in a separate folder in your local pc itself okay so you can use this code and if you have any uh, in my next video i'll show you how you can uh, show you uh, the file uploader in the same jsp page after upload is complete okay so hope you got this if you have any doubt in this please comment below i'll be helping you i'll share all the source code in my description you can have it and please like and subscribe for my videos and thanks for watching